I was almost on the news about Super Mario Bros. But unfortunately, they went with somebody else. And I'm definitely not bitter about that. They ask you how you are. You just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. But you just can't get into it because they would never understand. But be sure to leave a like and comment so maybe this video will get more views than that story did. And also subscribe so next time they might actually choose me. The goal's 4 million. But seriously, I did get reached out to by a news station to talk about my history with Super Mario Bros. And since I didn't get chosen for that, I thought, why not just do it myself? That would have been recorded before the Super Mario Bros. movie even came out. Now it's been out for a few days, I actually got to see it. We all know that it's doing fantastic at the box office, and I could say 100% confidently that that movie is fantastic. The Super Mario Bros. movie is just a fun ride. It is a love letter to fans. It is a love letter to anybody that has ever seen or played Super Mario Bros. So if you have not seen Super Mario Bros. yet, I don't know what you're doing. Go see it. Now the main question that they asked me is how does Mario stand the test of time and remain so iconic? I had trouble coming up with a simple answer for this and maybe that's why I wasn't chosen. But what I came up with is Mario is just plain fun. No matter how old you are, from 5 years old to 35 plus years old like myself, you just have fun playing Super Mario Bros. You just are happy when you see Super Mario in any capacity. When the trailers came out, I was really happy. And then when I was watching the Super Mario movie, I was smiling from ear to ear because I just love that property. It's just so fun and happy. And there's not many things that could say that this day and age so i think that's why mario has remained so iconic i know a lot of people have nostalgia for it but also kids love them too so it's just it's just a fun property for all ages and not many things could say that now i probably am bitter about the story but what you have to understand is i don't really get reached out to about a lot of things and i really don't get reached out to about things that i genuinely care about and love so i got excited and the way it went down was not very professional but it did give me the opportunity to look back at the impact that Super Mario Bros. has had on my life. They asked me about my history with the franchise and I told them the story about how I would play Super Mario Bros. at my grandmother's house when I was very, very young. I even told them that I think that there's a home video out there of me playing Super Mario Bros. at my grandmother's house and they said that that would have been a fantastic thing to show during the interview. So I called up my, my parents, told them what was going on. They were really excited about it as well so they started looking for some footage and fortunately they were able to find some home videos from 1992 meaning I was four years old at the time where I am playing Super Mario Bros at my grandmother's house. I will have it as b-roll but you could see how much fun I was having with that game rocking back and forth just engulfed in that world. I never had a NES growing up probably because i was only four years old and my parents thought hey that's probably he probably doesn't need that but my uncle did and he had it at my grandmother's house so that's what really introduced me to nintendo and to gaming in general so it had a huge impact on my life they found footage of me playing super nintendo with my sister now it's not super mario but we did play the heck out of Super Mario World growing up. I still have that Super Nintendo in this room. And I even have all the games that I had growing up. So Super Mario has been a part of me since a, I was four or five years old. And it has just followed me until now. Those videos are 30 plus years old at this point, And I'm still a huge Super Mario Bros fan. I just love that franchise so much and it means a lot to me. It's been a part of my life my entire life and that's why I enjoyed the Super Mario Bros movie and why it was so special to me. It's just a love letter to fans so go see it if you have not already especially if you love the Mario franchise or if you have any history with Super Mario Bros at any point in your life you will love that movie. But this was not a wasted experience. I had so much fun watching all the old home movies. My family loved watching the old home movies. So I implore you to go watch the movie, but also take some time to reflect on the past and just relive some great memories. But I wanna thank you all for watching. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. I'll talk to you all next time.